I farm in southeast North Dakota. We farm about 6,500 crop acres, and if you include my cattle operation, it's about 1,500 of hay and pasture and CRP and everything else. Main crop is corn and pinnel beans, soybeans, and some barley this year. David's always looking for the next best thing, and so am I. As an agronomist, we always want to try to capture more bushels. We always want to try to find the next best thing to be better on their farm. Don't care if it's for bigger bushels and more money, or if it's for just to help in the environment and doing the right things agronomically. So we've been using ESN for the last 10 years. Before ESN, we used a product that we would apply on the urea specifically. With ESN, when we got it brought to our attention, being that it's a polymer coated urea, it just seemed like even on the handling side, it was gonna be a lot better fit. And then we could hear all the benefits of how it would be controlled as far as the release, and it'll just be better for that application. When you get to trust somebody and you get the friendship side of it and they take care of you and you take care of them, I mean, things really can go a long ways. Getting way more efficiency out of the fertilizer and probably getting much better yields. I could go into some of my maps and almost prove to you in a yield map on how much better it actually has been lately. ESN, I don't know, you can make it as simple or sophisticated as you want. And if you want a simple farmer answer is you put ESN out and uh, the the environment is what'll break the polymer or the capsule and then the fertilizer or the nitrogen comes out. There's a lot of products out there to help you extend your nitrogen into the later part of the season. If you haven't tried ESN, it is one that is very convenient. You can physically, visually see it where a lot of these other products you're just hoping they're working and you're taking a lot of people's word for it. You can go out there in June start digging around, you'll find these pellets that aren't even being released yet. And that could be six weeks down the road, eight weeks down the road from application, knowing that that nitrogen is there and that polymer coating just to be released. It's for me just something that I'm a see it to believe it type of guy. So this is one product that you can see and I think it's gonna make a big difference on almost every farm out there.